developers of appreciative inquiry came up with a highly effective procedure for helping individuals and groups to discover all that useful information about what's already working and activate their default mode networks at the same time. That procedure is called the appreciative interview and you can use it with individuals or with groups at any scale. The appreciative interview has been described as the heart of appreciative inquiry. It really is the key activity of the discovery stage. Appreciative interviews are designed to collect rich qualitative information in the form of stories. Stories that carry a wealth of meaning and sometimes a powerful emotional charge rather than dry quantitative data consisting of figures and statistics or dry abstractions. The aim of the appreciative interview, as with the whole of the discovery stage, is to uncover the forces that give life to the team or the organization. Why do we do appreciative interviews? Appreciative interviews are based on an agreed affirmative topic so they're implicitly positive. Appreciative interviews gather new and maybe previously overlooked information about what's already working well and contributing to the success of what we want to see happen. Appreciative interviews raise people's morale by valuing their own personal experiences and contributions, making them more open to change. Appreciative interviews raise the sense of what's possible preparing the ground for the dream stage, which comes next. As they tell their stories and associate into their own positive reference experiences, people are more likely to come up with fresh insights than if they were asked to look at their experience in a detached and abstract way. You can actively engage large numbers of people at all levels of the organization as appreciative interviewers helping them to understand people in different roles and at different levels in the organization better, and to internalize an appreciative mindset. The key factor in appreciative interviews, I believe, is this. The assumptions and positive language built into the questions influence both interviewee and interviewer towards a more positive state of mind.